Hello everyone, it's uh, John from Introversion here. I wanted to say thanks to everybody for registering their support for the bugs. It's really uh, helping us support, uh, choose which bugs we're going to be working on. It's now uh, day three of the bug bash and we've already fixed quite a few bugs and uh, it's our intention to release the, some intermediate builds during this month uh, so that you can follow along with our progress. And indeed, you can see which bugs that we've been fixing here on the change log in Mantis. So let's go to the change log and we can already see which bugs that we've fixed. Here it is, Prison Architect Bug Bash 1, and there are all the bugs that we've fixed so far. Now, uh, as we release these uh, intermediate builds, it would be really great if uh, we could get some feedback on whether the bugs have indeed been fixed or if there are still outstanding issues or if it's not working for you. Uh, or uh, if you think that some other issue has been introduced uh, in the fixing of this bug or it hasn't been introduced quite right. right. So if you... Uh, so, so what we need to do is test the bugs uh, against the, bu uh, the bug bash builds. We're going to be releasing the intermediate builds on Steam using a, the Steam beta channel. Uh, and I'm going to show you how to do that right now. How do you get hold of the intermediate builds? Go to Steam. Uh, here I am in the Steam library. And this is the Prison Architect game. And in square brackets it says Bug Bash because that is the beta channel that I'm logged into. If you right click on Prison Architect in Steam and you go to Properties, then you go to Betas, you'll see Bug Bash there as one of the options in this beta that you would like to opt into. And so select it and then say Close and it should say Updating and then it'll say it in square brackets when it's finished, Bug Bash. If it doesn't show immediately, you may need to log in and log out again of Steam. Or log out and log back in, I mean. Okay, so let's test this bug. Um, let's have a look at this one here. For example, camera controls active when the focus is in menus. This is the one where uh, if you press WSAD or the mouse wheel while you're in a menu, it actually carries on uh, scrolling the world. Um, let's check it out. All right, so Andrew has fixed this, and uh, here are some repro reproduction st steps. Start the game, bring up the main menu, Click Save Game, Save Name using WASND keys. All right, let's try it. Let's open Steam. Okay, run the Bug Bash version. Okay, that's how we go. All right, here we go. So when we run a Bug Bash uh, build, the very important to check what version we're running. Uh, we open the main menu and have a look here on the bottom left, bug bash dash 1a. Okay, that's the build that we're running. And let's test the bug now. We zoom in a little bit. There you go. Is that enough? Probably not enough. Well, that's enough. You can see the road uh, on the right here. And so if we type WSAND, you can see that nothing's happening. Let's go to save prison. Uh, w, 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 nothing happening, S A, D, no, looking good, okay. So, uh, I think uh, that's fixed. We would want you to test a bit more thoroughly if you have time, uh, but any feedback is good. So now we come back uh, to the mantis, to the bug. This is the one. Um, we go all the way down to the bottom. And we say confirm fixed in bug bash 1a. Okay? And obviously, if it's not fixed, you would write something like uh, not fixed in bug 1a, bug bash 1a. And this feedback will be very helpful to us because if it's not fixed, we'll reopen the bug and have another crack at it. All right, so uh, thanks very much, guys. Uh, keep your feedback coming. We're really looking forward to hearing from you. Uh, take care and all the best.